Copper and histamine. Research suggests that copper plays a role in lowering histamine levels in the body. Diamine oxidase Dao, a copper-containing enzyme, breaks down excess histamine. Studies indicate that plasma diamine oxidase activity is higher in copper-adequate rats. Compared to copper marginal or copper deficient rats, Dao is a digestive enzyme produced in the kidneys, thymus, and the intestinal lining, primarily functioning to break down excess histamine in the zinc and copper interaction. Zinc is also known to lower histamine, potentially even more effectively than copper. However, when taking higher doses of copper, individuals might experience allergic reactions or histamine related symptoms. In such cases, taking a chewable zinc tablet can alleviate these symptoms. It's important to note that this initial reaction might occur when taking copper doses above 10 mg, but it usually subsides after a few weeks. Balancing copper and zinc. While zinc is considered a stronger antihistamine, it's crucial to strike a balance between copper and zinc intake. Taking excessive copper in relation to zinc, or consuming copper without zinc concurrently, can lead to potential issues. Some individuals have reported that copper might strip histamine from zinc. Although this interaction is not well documented in existing research, considering individual responses, it's worth mentioning that while some studies indicate zinc can block copper, the effects of taking copper above 10 mg remain relatively understudy. Individual responses to copper and zinc supplementation can vary, and finding the right balance is key to managing histamine levels effectively. As with any supplementation, it's advisable to consult with a healthcare professional before making significant changes to your mineral intake, especially when dealing with potential interactions between copper and zinc. Personalized guidance can help ensure safe and appropriate supplementation based on individual needs and responses.